Yo, what's up everybody? This is Dayton from Killinois Kennels again, coming back at you live and direct from the Killinois studios. In today's video, we're going to be introducing you to one of our newest upcoming studs, a dog that you guys have never seen before, and a dog that I'm super excited to show you guys. We're going to start off by showing you some footage of him. We're going to break down his pedigree. It's going to be a really good video, so make sure you guys stay tuned. If you're new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of our upcoming litters of American Bully Puppies or the videos we drop. And after we get done watching this one, make sure you go to our channel and check out some of our other videos. We got over 400 different videos of great American Bully content. But that's enough for all that, man. Let's go ahead and get into the footage you guys all came here to see. Well, here he is, you guys. Allow me to introduce you to one of our newest upcoming studs, our boy, Killinois Kennels Big Business. The crazy thing about this boy Biz is, is that he's barely over a year old, and this boy's got so much more growing to do. You know, for those of you that know us, man, we usually like to put our dogs in the cut, let them marinate before we bust them out. And you know, but we'd had no choice with this boy Biz here because he's got some big breedings going down right now. And we wanted to go ahead and put them out for you guys to see. This boy is the definition of a true pocket monster. He's got a really nice chest, real nice head, shoulders, neck, bone, total package pocket American bully. And like I said, this boy being just a tad bit over a year old, he's got so much more growing to do, man. When it's all said and done, this boy is going to be a force to be reckoned with. And I can't wait to see the final product. Not only does this boy have all the badass characteristics of American Bully, but he also brings color to the table. This boy's gonna be throwing that rainbow. You're gonna get your chocolates, champagnes, all that stuff. This boy biz is gonna be available for stud to approve females only. For anybody that's interested, get with us and we'll take care of you. All you gotta do is send us out some footage of your dog, send us the pedigree. We'll go over it and if everything checks out, we'll go ahead and go through with the breeding. For anybody that's part of the Killinois family and has purchased a dog from our kennel, if you decide to use one of our studs, we'll help you promote the litter on our channel as well. That doesn't mean that we're gonna promote everybody's litters or anything like that, man. But if you buy a dog from our kennel and you come back and use one of our studs, we will put it up on the channel. Don't forget, I've been in the talks with the whole Killinois camp and we're gonna be doing a puppy giveaway. But the only way we're gonna be doing a giveaway is we get support from you guys on the channel. Make sure you guys hit that like button, comment on those videos, share the videos, tell all your friends, man. We're shooting for 10K likes on a video. If we can get 10K likes on a video, we're gonna go ahead and do a puppy giveaway ASAP. We had all intentions on doing a puppy giveaway at 100K, but if we can get those 10K likes, we'll make it happen. But back to this boy Biz, man. This boy is a real good representation of an extreme show quality American bully like we always shoot for over here, man. But that's it for the footage of Biz. Now we're gonna go ahead and move on and break down his pedigree. It's gonna be a really good video, so make sure you guys stay tuned. We're gonna start off with Big Business's father. This is our boy, Killinois Kennels Applying Pressure, also known as Baby James. Just like Big Business's litter, Baby James' litter was real nice and consistent, and we're gonna show you some of his litter mates. This right here is gonna be Baby James' litter mate brother, our boy, Killinois Kennels God of War. And the reason why we show you guys the litter mates is we show you that our litters are nice and consistent and you don't just end up with one nice dog off a of litter, we end up with several and we show you that time and time again. This is gonna be another litter mate. This is our boy, BRC Global Grand Champion Killinois Jax and our girl, BRC Global Champion Killinois Armani. Soon we will have two champions and one grand champion from this litter alone. Here's another female from that same exact litter. This is gonna be our girl, Killinois Kennels, Beautiful Sitch. 
and another female as well. This is our girl, Killinoy Kennels Valkyrie. With that being said, you just seen six badass American bullies all coming from the same exact litter. Not only is Baby James a badass American bully, but his pedigree is second to none when it comes to the Dax line blood. We put in a lot of work when we created Baby James and his litter mates, and this pedigree is going to show it. What you're looking at right now is going to be the father of this litter. This is going to be Folk King Styles Raider. This boy is close to the public, and we're one of the few kennels that actually was able to have a litter off of this boy. This right here is going to be Raider's father. This is Grand Champion Rocco Mania, another badass American bully. And this boy is, you know, won the Nationals here in the United States, and he's won the Nationals over in Europe. This is another dog that we got heavy in our yard over here. We use this boy with our girl Stella, as seen here. We produce the dogs like this boy Ace of Spades and our girl Lauren London and many, many more. Make sure you guys stay tuned. We'll be showing you guys some of those other productions here soon as well. This right here is going to be Rocco's father, Eminence Boss, one of Dak's best producing sons. And this right here is going to be Rocco's mother, Lola, another real nice producing bitch. So we showed you Raider's father's side of the pedigree. Now we're going to go ahead and move on to the mother's side. This right here is going to be Raider's mother. This is Chilladrina. She comes off of Eminent Boss as well. So with that being said, Raider is two times Eminent Boss. On the bottom side of Raider's mom's pedigree, she goes back to this badass boy Phenom, another one of Dak's best producing sons, and she also has a tad bit of Razor's Edge blood in her. She goes back to two times Low Jack's Remy Martin as seen here. This is going to be Baby James's mother. This is our girl, Killinoy Kennel's Cardi Bean. She's another one of the many amazing females that we have on the yard over here. And this girl threw it down with her first litter with that boy Raider. Now we're going to go ahead and show you a couple of her litter mates. This is going to be our boy, Killinoy Kennel Stacks. And the reason why we show you the litter mates is we show you that these dogs come from generations and generations of badass dogs. Not just one fluke dog out of the litter. This right here is going to be Cardi Bean's sister. This is our girl, Xena, and again, all three of the next dogs you guys are going to see all came from that same litter that Cardi Bean did. This right here is Killinoy Kennel's tank, and again, he's the litter mate brother to Cardi Bean and another real badass boy. This right here is going to be Cardi Bean's father on the left. That's Muscle Tone Bully's Mr. Bean stacked up next to Grand Champion Rocco right there. Both of these dogs are going to be in Baby James's pedigree. Here's another little look at Mr. Bean. This dog was sold out to the UK for a huge amount of money, just like his father. This right here is going to be Mr. Bean's father. This is Muscle Tone Bully's Mr. Magoo. And this boy is now located in China and sold for over $750,000. And this boy is one of Dax's best producing sons as well. RIP to Gotti Lines Dax and his creator, Ed Shepard. Now we're going to go ahead and move on to Cardi Bean's mother. This is our girl, Stella. She's another one of the many amazing females that we have on the yard over here. And this girl has put it down for our kennel. Some of your guys' favorite dogs come off of this girl right here. Or they go back to her blood, but this girl threw it down for us. This right here on the right is going to be Stella's father. That's champion Lucky Luciano stacked up next to Muscle Tone's Mr. Bean, the dog that we bred Stella to to get our boy Stax, Cardi Bean, Tank, Xena, and all them dogs. Here's another little clip of Lucky Luciano stacked up next to Grand Champion Rocco. Another nice clip I figure I'd add to the pedigree. This right here is going to be Lucky Luciano's father. This is the late, great Gotti Lines Dax. And this right here is going to be Lucky Luciano's mother, which actually goes back to some of our blood with our boy, Killinoy Kennels Debo. This right here is going to be Stella's mother. This is Kang Kennel Shaka Khan. She's a heavy bred Dax female. She coming out of a breeding with 217 Gotti Lines Goldie and 217 Gotti Lines Nunu, which was actually a Dax son bred to a Dax daughter. 
This right here is gonna be Big Business's mother. This is our girl, Killinoy Kennels, Nala. And this right here is gonna be Nala's litter mate sister. This is our girl, Killinoy Kennels, queen. Here's another litter mate to Queen and Nala. This is gonna be our girl, Killinois Kennels, Elsa. And again, this is the reason why we're showing you the litter mates, man. Nothing but badass American bullies coming off of our litters over here at the Killinois camp. This is gonna be Nala's father. This is our boy, Mowgli. He was inbred Dax, which makes him two times Gotti Lines Dax. And he's also two times Gotti Lines Romeo. This is gonna be Nala's mother. This is our girl, Killinois Kennels Harley Quinn. She come off of our boy Porkchop, a badass primetime son, and our girl, Killinois Trinity, a primetime daughter. That boy primetime goes back to some exclusive Razor's Edge blood. And this right here is gonna be Trinity's mother, our girl, Killinois Kennels Nuisance. Don't forget, for any of you guys that are looking to join the Killinois family, we have a real nice litter of America Bully puppies that are gonna be for sale this coming Sunday. These are gonna be the pups you're looking at right now. On the left, we got two boys, and on the right, we got two girls. I'm gonna link in the description of this video that'll take you straight to the videos that is promoting this litter. We're gonna have a video that'll show the breeding, it'll show you plenty of footage of the parents and break down the pedigree, and then we'll also show you the video where there's tons of footage of these puppies running around, all the footage you guys wanna see. We got some big things going down for the Killinois family. We're gonna be working on some events just for the Killinois family. What you're looking at right now is gonna be the father of that litter. This is gonna be our boy, Killinois Kennels Vanilla Gorilla, one of our main studs on the yard over here. And this is gonna be the mother. This is our girl, Killinois Shiva. Super nice litter of America bully puppies, man. Anybody that's looking for some foundation blood or just a badass dog to have, this is gonna be a perfect litter for you guys, man. And we'll be putting those puppies up for sale on Sunday. You know, just as excited as you guys are to add one of our Killinois dogs to your family. We cannot wait to add all you guys to the Killinois family. And like I said, we got some big things going down for our Killinois family members. We're thinking about having some personal shows just strictly for the Killinois family. That way you guys can all come out. We'll get some good footage of your dogs and put them on the channel. Lots of big things going down. Don't forget, not this weekend, but the next weekend, November 26th, we got a huge BRC Global Show going down in Stockton, California. I'll be out there judging in this event, and we'll be also doing a Killinois Kennel show vlog on it as well. So if you guys wanna come out and get in on the show vlog, make sure you do so. You're more than welcome to come out, promote your dogs, promote anything you got going on. And if you don't wanna get on camera, you just wanna come out and meet us at the Killinois camp, you do not have to get on camera, man. But make sure you at least come up and introduce yourself. It's always good running into our subscribers and followers out at these events we're gonna be out there with a couple cameras it's gonna be a really good video this video should do really good on our YouTube channel so again if you want to get out there and promote your dogs make sure you do so it's gonna be a really good time not only is this gonna be a dog show but it's gonna be a car show as well they're gonna have donks low riders trucks all types of stuff out there. It's gonna be at the Oak Grove Park in Stockton, California. And the address and all the information is on this banner right here. If anybody needs any help, feel free to give me a call at 217-280-0151. And there are booths still available. If you haven't already, make sure you guys get over to Instagram, follow us at Killinois underscore kennels. We just hit 10K followers on there. I need to update this thumbnail right here. And you know, also make sure you guys get over there to TikTok and follow us at Killinois Kennels as well. We just reached over a thousand followers on there, man. We've been dropping a lot of exclusive content that you guys do not see on YouTube. So again, make sure you guys get over there and check us out. I wanna send a major shout out to the Killinois family. 
everybody that's purchased a dog from our kennel everybody's taking real good care of them dogs and sending out us footage to put up on the channel big shout out to you guys i also want to send a shout out to all of our supporters everybody showing love on the videos hitting that like button commenting sharing our videos telling their friends about our channel we just blew past 55,000 subscribers and we couldn't have got there without all your guys's help man we got major things coming to the channel make sure you guys stay tuned i'm telling you man you guys ain't ready for what we got coming